Um, I think the Charlo brother. How do you think he does against Charlo? Well, that's the fight I have to sing because one thing I can say, um, not be present or anything, African Americans, they move a little different. And, you know, to me, Canelo imitates movement like an African American. So African American people, they move a little different. So, you know, I have to see, you know, even though uh, we're going to see him move with Danny Jacobs, but like I said, we seen him move with Danny Jacobs who, who have a loss. Whereas though this Chalo brother, he doesn't want a loss. So he's going to do everything in his power to stay undefeated. And you know, whoever come in the ring, he feel like he the champion of the world already. So that's going to be more of an um, interesting fight for me. When you say you move like a black fighter, can you describe that? Well, like, uh, you know, we, we move effortless. Like, uh, give you an example, Sugar Ray Robinson, uh, Cornell Street T. Whitaker, um, Floyd Mayweather, Sugar Ray Leonard, Muhammad Ali. You know, we effortless movers. We get out the, we, we, we get out the way of punches, and it might look like to you, we barely got away from that punch, but we, we been knew we was gonna get away from that punch. So, you know, and it's called effortless movement. And that's how African Americans move. And lately, with Canelo fight, ever since he fought Floyd, he's been effortless moving. So that's why I feel like he imitates an African American with his movement. If you had to guess, how do you think he developed that movement? By and the reason I ask is usually non-black fighters that move like that have a black trainer that taught it to them. And I don't think he has any black trainers in the state. Well, right now, because of social media, uh, you can, you know, you can sit down and you can study films. You know, just like a, 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 a test. You can study a footwork. You can study uh, hand movement, head movement. You can study it. And you know, you keep moving. You keep watching something over and over again. And you go and you try to em emulate it. You know, time to time, pretty much, you get better and better with it. And you know, you when you, when you, when you, the way you learn it is, start spawning people who love not have that type of movement. And when you spot them, you start trying them movement. And you spot people that's not on your level so you can get confidence of how to move like that. And once you learn how to move like that, then you take it from the, the spawn session into the real fight.